Alrighty, in this one, we're going to go over how to draw a T-Rex versus Triceratops. Uh, and they're going to be like kind of facing off, ready to do battle. Um, love dinosaurs. Uh, go check out the dinosaur playlist. I'm going to put that in the description uh, if you're a fan. Uh, if there's any dinosaurs I haven't drawn, or maybe like a dinosaur scenario, let me know in the comments section and I will make it happen, okay? Let me do that for you. So otherwise, let's hop right into the lesson immediately and let's get started. Hey, how's it going? Let's go over this T-Rex versus Triceratops. Let's draw Triceratops over here, T-Rex over here, okay? Let's get started. So there's definitely gonna be a height discrepancy and I'm gonna make that obvious here. So first thing I do here is I'm gonna start with the eye of the Triceratops right there. It looks like a peanut kind of, or a leaf. Curve right there for the pupil, an iris, uh, or not the iris, sorry, just the pupil really. Line over here for the eye. <laughs> or the top of the eye, I mean, the ridge of the eye. And then right above the ridge of the eye is gonna be the horn. It's actually on Line over here for the horn. Down. I'm not gonna draw the other one quite yet. I'm gonna go over here, down, over here. Kind of the upper snout area. All right, I'm gonna go to the far end and I'm gonna draw the other horn. Right? <laughs> All righty. Gonna go to the top of the head here, pull up, pull back for that crown. We're gonna start with that crown because that, that crown's kind of hard to get out of the way. Pulling up over here, curve around, down, line over here, line in here for the cheek, up, down. for the horn right there, so the front horn. Pulling out, down, because there's like a beak. I don't know why Triceratops says it's gonna be curve. Okay. Pull back there. Go underneath here, underneath there. Lower mouth. <sighs> and then jaw back here. Underneath the neck. Let's go over here, the, the line over here for the beak, line over for the beak, line over here for the horn right here, and there's going to be a dot here for the nostril curving in here. Line, line, along the horn just to give it a texture. And then on top of the eye there, see how there's a ridge, I'm going to draw like scales in that area just a bit for that area let's go over here and draw the horns there's actually horns like little triangles here on the end of that the, that crest curve over here curve over here Curve just a little bit to see the texture on the actual, you know, area right there on the on the crest. Maybe you can even throw some small lines over here to give it some texture. Right? And then you could just, uh, if you want, you could throw like a line there for the back of the neck and a um, line over here for, I don't know, the lower, lower body that's going to kick in. So that's it for the Triceratops. For now, I mean, I can always throw these See these curved little lines right here, like little C shapes? And you put them enough places, it will uh, resemble, uh, what do you call it, um, texture. And it'll look like, uh, it, it'll look like scales. Uh, but I wanna throw another little line here really quick for underneath the neck. I'm just, I'm gonna throw a little bit of a dark here as well. A little bit of dark. Mm. 
<laughs> All right. Okay. Uh, let me put another curved line there for the back. But let's jump into the T-Rex, okay? T-Rex is going to be a little higher. So I'm going to draw right there for the top of the snout. Down. Got to make sure it doesn't go off the page. Over here, it's going to be the eye. Ridge of the eye. And it's going to go, there we go. That part's going to go off the page, but I don't want the, the eye. I want to place the eye over here. That's going to be the most important part. Over here, up, down, for where the eye is. Curve down here. Right there, looks like a Pac-Man sign. His, he's got more of a focal eye. His eyes are more aimed forward, while Triceratops are more aimed outward, usually, because it's a prey animal, and they just tend to evolve that way. Down over here. Curve underneath. And curve over here for the cheekbone, or jugo bone, I think you call them dinosaurs. Curve right there for bag under the eye. Gonna make an exclamation point for, <coughs> for the nostril there. And I'm gonna throw some teeth sticking out the mouth right here. Down over here, back. Down over here, curve up. And line here. All right. Curve line here, because that's usually where the ears are for a lizard. Curve line over here. And now I'm gonna draw a line from the middle of the jaw here, and it's gonna be the throat. <laughs> draw a throat there. Line over here. And then you draw a little bit more dark over here. Curve over here. I'm gonna draw the same like general lines over here over the eye because the ridges are there. And I'm gonna do this thing. I'm gonna draw these little semicircles. To replicate um, scales. Let me draw a thicker one here. Like a vein over here or something. You put it down here as well. Well, there's going to be more of the soft belly area, but he'll he'll probably still have it. <laughs> and I can still put it over here too. But you can kind of what you can kind of do as far as the scales go. You can, if you want, you can make them match like the number. Like I can just like I put them over here. I can pepper more over here just to kind of make it look like it's a unified image. Um, and that's kind of the, mostly the most important part. So that is Triceratops versus T-Rex. Um, I think T-Rex is probably gonna kind of gonna get him. I think, to be honest. But anyways, that's pretty much it. I hope you enjoyed that. If you want more dinosaur versus dinosaur, let me know. Hit the subscribe and click the bell notification. I should have said that at the beginning. If you like this kind of stuff, hit that like. Likes are the reason the channel survives. Also, if you do want to support the channel, there's two ways you can do it. One, donate to the channel, or you know, the PayPal, every single cent goes to markers. Every single cent. I use, like, look at this. I use tons of these things. Tons. And these are all, like, dried out already. So, um, or you can also share the video. And that's absolutely amazing. Thank you so much. I will see you next time. Hey, for those of you that are a little bit more serious and you really want to kind of upgrade your art skill all around, uh, I have these beginner art lessons here on my Skillshare. So the idea with this is that some people that, you know, for example, on YouTube, people just kind of want to draw what's in the video and just generally have a fun time. They're not always concerned about the little details and stuff about learning uh, how to do this stuff, you know, long term. Um, and I get that. That's fun. But for some people, some people want to upgrade their art ability entirely, like all around, like they're serious about it. If that's you, go here. Um, like I said, there's programs here on even some of the same material. Like I said, it's just a lot more in depth. 
my eye drawing program is an hour as opposed to the video I have on YouTube, which is like 10 minutes, right? You can still learn from both, but like I said, if you really want more and you really want to make this part of your life, go here. Um, I have same thing over here, how to draw a dragon head. I have anime, I have cartoons. There's categories for everything and everything is for beginners. Um, the other thing about this website is it's incredibly easy to watch it. This is like the Netflix of like drawing lessons. So you can go through the entire site, see everybody else's lessons. And normally the, the site costs like 30 to 40 bucks a month. Um, because you're watching this video right now, if you're still watching right now, you get it for free for at least a month, like 30 days, that's a lot. Um, but just you, what you have to do is go over here to the video, go down first link in the description, the very, very first link that gives you free access to this whole thing for 30 days. Um, you just go over here, you click this thing, boom, and then you sign up. Um, and it's super easy. And the, the cool part is you can just straight up cancel it before the 30 days is up and you never pay a single thing. You never pay a cent and you got all this learning from it. Uh, but yeah, like I said, that's uh, an option for you guys. Uh, if you guys want to do it, absolutely go hit that up. Um, and that's it. So talk to you later and uh, hopefully I'll see, I'll catch you over there later. Thank you so much. You are amazing. Uh, over here on the right, you're going to see my most recent upload. And on the top corner over here, you're going to see just another selection, another cool selection that has to do kind of with the subject of this video. Uh, and over here at the top, you can hit the subscribe to see a lot more. Uh, this is awesome, and I'll see you next time.